Oh, what's going on guys? Man Elite here and welcome back to my Final Fantasy 16 player through. We've just hit Rosalith and it is getting absolutely destroyed by Lord Kupka. So we need to protect our hometown and whoop Titan's ass. <sighs> Too powerful. I wonder how tall will get up the lemon ladders. Oh, cheeky chest. So we can go up that way, we'll come through there. Is anything down here quickly? Not a thing. We're nearly at the castle. It ends there. As if Titan just comes out from the middle of the castle and just like it and just implodes. Bye castle. <laughs> I mean, that would send a signal, send a sign, totally demoralise Clive. Good amount of XP, that. Is it him? No. Set her loose. Huh? Is that a oh, it's a curl. I thought it was a behemoth. Huh?
We got this. Attack! Ready? What do you think? If I could just turn into Ifri, like this would be so freaking easy. Let's make this count. It's actually really easy. It should maybe level us up. Never mind. Ah! Jill. We meet at last. Have you been grabbed? Or should I say, Lord Rosfield? I've been looking for you for a very long time. Let her go, Kuka. <laughs> I'm so glad you accepted my invitation. I went to some trouble with the decorations. <laughs> Do you like what I've done with the place? Bastard. <laughs> Such a pity your predecessor couldn't join us. But I am sure you will prove compelling company. Be still, little snowflake. I would not have you melt before your starring moment. You let him do that, you fuck. Too much for a fight. Now, on to the festive.
a toggle. Uh, that's just great, that is. I suppose it's up to me then. We play as Gav? <laughs> Imagine. Don't, don't give me control of Gav, whatever you do. I don't want to play no Assassin's Creed where I've got to sneak in and out of shit. Oh, is this a chopping block for our heads? Headsman! Oh, it is. <laughs> Do you want me? What did you think? Bloody chopping block in the middle of the you lemon courtyard. <laughs> yeah, it's no more than she deserves for getting into bed with an outlaw. <laughs> we should get into mine. <laughs> Serve. Lord Kupka commands your presence. You're to bear witness to the girl's execution. Such a waste. <laughs> Gav. Shh. Crystal fetters are a bastard to open, just so you know. Don't worry, I'll have them off before you can blink. What is Jill? In the courtyard. Shit. We have to hurry. The Imperials have sounded the retreat and cleared out of the castle. But the place is still swarming with Kupka's men. Leave them to me. I'll make my way up top and circle round the back. Quick as you like, eh? Bloody sword. Thank you. Nearly forgot. Hold on, Jill. I'm coming. You might as well keep your sword out. I mean, it sounds like we're gonna have a fight. I have to get to the courtyard. And the courtyard we will get to, buddy. But first, we've got to make sure none of these doors open. Don't leave any loot tonight. Good job we're getting loads of portions. Don't you let her die. You've got a plan, Clive, because we are fucked if you don't. Yeah, I'm going to go in a whiff for it and just rain hell, fire and brimstone. Why has he never done this before? What the fuck even is that? EMP? Oh, he's transformed! Jill and get the frick out of it. Lord Rosby. Don't tell me you tire of my entertainment. Enough. Yes. Perhaps it is time we served the main repast. I trust you are hungry. 
Oh my god, like, just come down here and fight me yourself. Stay close. We're getting out of here. And Toggle, thank you. What even is Toggle? Looks like a mini Ramu bombit. Yes, do you, do you care? Inside the castle. I can try. Who wants to fight now? Is Titan finally gonna get up off his chair? We also leveled up. Level 31 now. It's over. For now. But I bet that wasn't the last of them. And they won't stop hunting us until Koopka's dead. So you get in there and finish the job, eh? Go on. If they come again, we'll hold them back. All right. But be careful. Yeah, because if he transforms into Titan, this whole place is gone. Bye-bye! Right, let's go. Forward to this. He'll die by my hand. I mean, 
Sid kind of did send the guy his fancy woman's head chopped off in a box. I don't know if you know about that. Just enjoying your entertainment. How gratifying. Have you come to defend your father's throne, Lord Rosfield? Watch him just punch straight through it. <laughs> the Grand Duchy of Rosaria. A realm without a ruler. An army. Even a people. A veritable kingdom of dust. Truly, I see no throne to defend. Thought you fucking dare. You absolute douche. Oh. I knew he was going to do something like that. You could just tell. He's that type of guy. Just tell me what you want. Sid's head in a box. Imagine my disappointment when I learned that he met his end at the hand of another. And my relief to learn that you had taken up his thrice damned name. Knew it was Benedicta's head in a box. It was all Game of Thrones. Your master slew Benedicta Harmon and defiled her body. If you choose to bear that murderer's name, then you shall answer for his crimes. The only crimes I shall answer for are my own. Sid did everything in his power to save that woman. Though she was long past saving. And so I did what he couldn't. It was me all along, Hugo. It was... you. Show, you, show him Garuda's power. <laughs> you killed her. My games. I did. Show him the power. Took her power. Look. Do do do. <laughs> Mess with him. Come on. <laughs> then I am fortunate indeed. I had thought the most I could wish for was to take the life of one he loved, just as he did to me. But it seemed. I was wrong. And I shall have my revenge. Now. We, we shared a dream. I would be the king of the world. She would be my queen. And together, we would rule like the gods we are. You crushed that tree, ground into dust. We're standing in the Thanos. Hear me, You will pay for what you've done. I'll tear you apart with my hands. Go for it. <laughs> what have you? How many people have you killed? How many dreams have you crushed? You're not the only one who's seen their world fall apart around them. You'll get no pity from me, Kuka. Time to go Super Saiyan, no Clive. And no mercy. Now die! <laughs> yes! Oh, 
Need to be quicker than that, buddy. You recognize this move? What about this one? Did says hello, by the way. Powered up to Ipri yet? Like, I'll destroy him. You will die by my hand, Prostate. My hatred for you is unending. A real thing. Let this palace be your grave. What? Oh, why well, was flipping the table? Oh, shit. Yeah. <laughs> Where's he gone? Knock him into the center of the earth. Well, you got big guy. For a rocket, you know. <laughs> uh oh, he's lost it. The world has chosen. I am in my element. There's no escape. What the fuck is that? The earth will always be my domain. How do you get out of this? Yeah. <laughs> 
Digga. supposed to do without one. Actually, massively disappointed we didn't fight him in his huge time for a but... Oh well. I didn't even need to turn it away for it to be him. Cut his hands off. <laughs> yes. Now we're getting more of Game of Thrones. You need a hand, Matt. Take his head. Son of a whore! Uh oh, it's turned off, but. Oh, am I taking his powers? Take his powers. person you're going to achieve killing is yourself because a big rock's going to fall and pop you on the head. I honestly swear I have not seen this. Oh, I did kill him. Hallelujah. I thought he was going to go the same way Jamie Lannister and Cersei Lannister went. Killed by a rock. There, there. 
You mustn't get yourself worked up. Who the fuck are you? Wait! Another time, Mythos. I guess we're not done fighting Titan. Is that all of them? I think so. Well, Ludus scum. Who the fuck invited them? Not that that's the biggest surprise we've had to do. Where did you learn to do that toggle? <coughs> Not telling, eh? Suit yourself. Gav, we have to find Clive. Right, sorry. <sighs> Not if Clive finds you first. You missed one. We were worried. So was I. I was so close. If it hadn't been for my gift, I would have finished him. I'm just glad you got out of there alive. Don't forget to tell him you chopped his hands off. When did the Royalists arrive? Right after you went inside. Just when we thought we were shot of Titans, lot. Oh, it was Odin in that grabbed him. Not enough of them to worry us, though. No. You didn't see the one who took Kukra away. So, what? You think they came here to save him? Well, I'll be fucked if I know what's going on, but every minute we spend racking our brains, that bastard's getting further away. So what do we do? Return to the hideout. We go back to the hideaway. I know I'm in charge. I'm too tired to think. As are you, by the looks of it. And after what Jill's been through. Let's worry about Kuka later, shall we? Yeah, I've already whooped his ass once. There's Aye. no way in this world right. you can get brand new hands. Well, give us a chance to solve the riddle of your magic mud, too. Oh, a lot more of the castle survived than I thought. You did it, Dad. Right, so the only place I can go is the hideout now. Yeah, I'm down for that. Just look at the state of you. You're more of a wreck than this place. Is this what you call taking better care of yourself? No more excuses, your ladyship. I order you to rest. Fine. I'll rest. Don't worry, Gav. She's in good hands. But we should have never let her fall into Hugo's. Back when he had some like. Ah. The question is, where is he now? And what the hell were those royalists doing there? Hmm. I was wondering about that all the way home. Otto may have heard something. I'll talk to him. And I'll talk to Tomes. The Lawsman? About what? About your faithful hound for a start. If any four-legged friends ever done that before, I'm betting Tomes will have read about it. 
But what I want to know is, what happens afterwards? It's all well and good Toggle saving our asses, but if it costs him what it costs Jill... Right. Let me know if you learn anything. Will do. And you do the same, eh? Jill. Listen to Taya. I will. Thank you. There we go, we got the power of Earth. I really want the block move, if I'm honest. Right, so we've got new hunt. <clears throat> Two new hunt. Or oh, one new hunt. I believe that's level 38, so I don't think we really want to mess with that one. How may I help you today, Clive? We need 295 for that, we're 70 away, so let's not bother. Quickly go to the, the potion vendor. And the blacksmith. Jill looked white as a sheet. Is it business or pleasure? If you're gonna buy some, be quick about it. You'll not find a better price than that. It is better I'll be here. Is that all? All you've got? What do you need? The same for you, dear. We'll get the gelatin and mass from the hunt, I believe. Yeah, that should do you. Well, we should power the sword up a little bit. It's all right. out to the curse breakers and their other friends in the west asking them to keep their eyes peeled for anything unusual no leads yet but it's only a matter of time all right let me know when you find something there he is all right clive and what still busy saving the world well you know what mid when did you get back just now. What about your studies? Adjourned. Since Hugo Kupka invaded Rosaria. All the canvas in uproar about it. He's gone mad. He's turned rogue. It'll be us next. You try concentrating with all of that. All right, all right. You win. How long will he be staying this time? Dunno. 
A while, most likely. Any road, while I'm here, I was hoping you could do us a favor. Uh oh. Mid. You can't just expect me to. Please oblige her. <sighs> while we are busy tracking down Kupka, you should have a little time to spare. Professor! Now there's a face I haven't seen in a while. Should you have it buried in a dusty old tome? <laughs> I did, till a familiar trill pricked my ears. As ever, your exuberance is a breath of fresh air, which successfully scattered the painstakingly assembled fragments of my thoughts. I'll take that as a compliment. Well, Clive, you heard the professor. So, I'll meet you in the storeroom when you're done. Wait, hold on. Breath of fresh air. Bloody tempest, more like. Oi, Otto, you got my gill. Huh? What are you all about? My fee for bringing Mid across. She said you were paying. That little. The storeroom, was it? I wonder what Mid's plotting. Right. Bell no sit quests. I will quickly speak to Mid and see what she would like. Shouldn't you be getting some rest? You took your time. I'm a busy man, Mid. I'll get to the point then. I want to turn the room down there into a workshop like the one I had at Dad's place. Mid, you've only just come back. And? I've been thinking about it for a while. What type of workshop, though? Dad said I had a knack for engineering. Told me everything he knew about it. Then sent me off to Canva to learn everything he didn't. That was his dream for me. That one day I'd put my studies to use for the good of the cause. But I'm helping no one stuck at school. I've studied enough. It's time I put my knack to work. I know that I can help the people here. And I want to do it. Well, well, well. If Sid could see you now. All right? I'll tell Otto you'll be staying. I knew you'd say yes. Which is why I wrote up a list of jobs for you. For me? Who else? <sighs> what do you want me to do? First things first, I need equipment and materials to start making my own. There's the design to the stuff I need and the stuff it needs smithing from. The other materials I can work myself. Just need a generous benefactor to lay them on for me. Apart from the wood, I'll need a carpenter for that, but I can just borrow yours. Is that everything? For now. I'll let you know if I need out else. What demanding. <sighs> Where's it start? Materials and tools. That means Karen and Blackthorn. Alright guys, we're gonna end it there. Appreciate you all stopping by and supporting the video. I hope you enjoyed it. It was a very, very productive one. We defeated two hunts. I'm pretty certain uh, we did a couple of quests as well, as well as whoop Titan's button, took two of his hands, so yeah, pretty spicy. So be sure to like the video, subscribe if you want to see the next episode, where we hopefully get down to Wooden Odin. So have a great day, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!